Hello, lovelies. Welcome to Mama G Gear. Mama G here and sort of apologizing for the uh, video technique today. I do not want to be seen and trust me, you don't want to see me either <laughs> unless you want to be frightened. Okay, it's too early in the morning for horror movies. Um, yeah, what well, have you set up? I don't know if you could see on camera, but it's literally a coffee a huge coffee can with my very thick dog owner veterinary handbook uh and the uh, whatever you call tripod bendy thing which i absolutely love if you don't have one get one it's you can screw it onto things you know and then also bend it in any any direction um but that is attached to a 8 by 10 canvas that is unpainted okay so what's in front of you a big box and a little pink bag. And we all know who this is from. Our sweet, lovely Bridget at Queen's Crafts by Bridget. I'll tag her below if, if for some reason you don't know her. She spins, she dyes yarn and fiber and sews and crochets and knits and has a goat. That's most important to know is that she has a baby goat. And anyway, and she puts up baby goat videos just for me, but you are also invited to look at them if you'd like. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. See, you don't even want to know my brain right now today. So anyway, I know what's in here. I'm super stoked about this. And as you all know, um, if you own a project bag or a tote or something made by Bridget, you're allowed to sit at the cool kid table in the lunchroom. And because she sits at the head of the table, but and I'm right next to her because I probably have <laughs> purchased several of her bags. So let's open this. This here is kind of a boring box, so I'll open this first because. And you know what's really weird is Bridget, if you're watching, you have my the name on that you that you send in the mailing address is my maiden last name, which, yeah, of course you don't get a married first name, my maiden name and my nickname, which is spelled incorrectly as normal people would spell it, which is the way I spell it. But it just strikes me kind of funny that you have those names as the mailing address. Anyway, enough of that crap. Um, oh, okay, don't look. Close your eyes, everybody. And we got a card. And it's another pink thank you. It says, thank you, my sweet, wonderful friend. A queen bag made by a queen for a queen. Love Queen's Crafts by Bridget. Absolutely, girl. That's right, queen. Mm-hmm. You wear that crown. Sashay, sashay, sashay. Oh, something in here. Oh, look at I got a, I got a little... Excuse my hands because the box... Is, bit, is really dirty. Look at my hands are filthy just from touching the box. Isn't that, let me go over here. That's a queen crown stitch marker and that goes with my other ones. All right, so what I, she had shown this material and I immediately was like on the email, girl, you gotta make me this. So she did. This is officially a new product <laughs> that Bridget will be making because I'm going to make her do it. It's got that really nice, sturdy uh, draw handle. I didn't want to draw a string because I want to wear use this as a carry bag when I go out. And she, oh, she put snaps on it. Go girl. Awesome. So there's snaps on the top and green, which she knows I love. But this is a goat tote. Come on. Who doesn't want a goat tote? Well, I would rather have a goat, but since I can't have the, her goat, I have a goat tote. Look at all these adorable goats. And I told her I'm going to try to name them all. Yeah, I really need to start taking more meds. But anyway, I am going to try to name them all. Look at this little guy eating grass. Oh, good, because it's repeated, so I don't need a lot of names. I just need this amount of names. So yeah, if you come up with any good names, we will tag these goats and name them. This is adorable. It's a gorgeous bag and I can't wait. It's perfect, girl, and the green lining inside. Yeah. So I got a goat tote. Nobody else has a goat tote. I like being special. 
Oh, I've always been called special. Oh, okay. Now this is, I thought this box was boring because I thought this was more of the, um, I love having no memory because it's a surprise every day. I can hide my own Easter eggs. Um, I thought this was bear yarn. It's from Little Knits and it's not bear. It's far from bear. <gasps> Girls and boys and in-betweens, look what we have here. Oh my gosh, I'm super stoked. Oh, I wished I was sitting to show you these. <gasps> yeah, okay, all righty. These are, I forgot, I really, truly, completely, 100% forgot that I ordered, I, that I ordered this. I am so excited. Okay, so nitpicks. Let's see if they have a, well, it's probably on the bottom if they do have it. This was, if I'm remembering correctly, um, ha uh, Hanks that they were just random. It was like a ha Hank mystery bag. Okay, get the words out, woman. Jeez Louise. All right. This is Rio du Soleil, Campo di Rosa, Rosie, Venice at Night. This is a When in Rome, and the other one is When in Rome. So we got two When in Rome's. Can you see this? Two When in Rome's, Venice at Night, Campo di Rosi. That one's really pretty. Look at that. It's got all kinds of colors. Very rainbowy. And the last one was Rio de Soleil. Wow. Uh, let's see if I can find... I don't want to open the bags because I like to keep them in here. It's 100% superwash merino. It's 100 grams. There's 240 yards or 220 meters per hank, and it's a three weight. Yeah, super gorgeous. And could it be true? I let's say so. The same in this bag. So I have two, 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 and four because there's two of those in there. So that's super exciting. Oh my gosh, I like totally forgot about this. All right, these are Argentina color. Yeah, schmiggly off. I have no idea what that says. Let's try it. S it's it's S-C-H-A-C-H-E-N-M-A-Y-R. Sha. Chen Mer, right? Probably close. Uh, 28 yards. This is uh, SMC, not sure. 80% acrylic, 20% nylon, made in China. Colorway is Parte, P A R T I E. I guess they pronounce it Parte, but I like to say Parte. And I got three of these, and this, you know, well. Do you care? I'll, I'll open one up just because I want to show you the different. It's not like your normal yarn. This is like, uh, I almost said vanity yarn. I meant to say novelty, but I said, oh my gosh, it's super soft. I've had, I have had these before. This just crazy yarn and I'm not really like the fishnet stuff. Not really sure. There's got to be a specific reason or, or a way to crochet with this. And I do believe somebody did steer me in the proper direction and then I faded off and got distracted and never went there but uh yeah I, I just thought these colors were really super gorgeous and if I could figure out how to do it where you do have that fishnet yeah I don't know why I bought them but they were cool I'm assuming all of this was on sale because that's the way I buy things on sale all right wait now what do we have looks like two oh there's an invoice this might be helpful. And we have two of these painted clouds. Just check in the invoice. And one of three. All right. Argentina color art deco mix, which is what I just showed you. I had ordered. Oh, I got those free with my purchase of $50 or more. Okay, that's cool. And these guys, this is the Collective Painted Clouds Mystery Bag, 10 skeins, $37.38, 
for this, and I bought two of them. The hand-painted mystery bag skein of five. That was on sale for $32.99, and I also bought two of those. So this was $32.99. So you do the math if you divide that um, by five, and then you got shipping and all that stuff. So, Oh, and it, it hand, hand wrote here, Virginia, enjoy your yarn. That's very nice. I like personal stuff. But anyway, that's from uh, Little Knits. Hi, Little Knits, and thank you for my box. All right, these are gorgeous. Very interesting. Roving. Am I, wait, let, let me just slide the box up. There's two of these, so we don't need to have the box up in their face. These are gorgeous. Okay, so the, the colors, being that I got two and both are the same, we have six uh, donuts of that, six donuts, and six donuts. Let's turn it on this side to look at those gorgeous colors. And as you could see, it's really roving. I'm loving this right here. That that selection with the purple green and and uh, mustard, and then pink, blue, and mustard. But that's all. No, oh, all right, maybe I'm wrong. Okay, all right, I'm just noticing because I'm not that observant. I would never be a good detective. Uh, three of these, three of these, which are clearly bigger balls or bigger donuts. I almost said bigger nuts. Um, two of these and two of these. So we have the same. So that's where it makes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It makes ten. Look at me counting. All right. Do you want to know the colorway? This is Early Sunset. Purple Rain by the artist formerly known as Prince. Marble Caves. And the one that I like the best, I just don't want to open the... I want to keep them in the plastic as much as possible because I do have an animal house, you know, and I, I'm i used to the animals, but, you know, other people aren't, and if I do share stuff out, I like to keep it as clean as possible. And, of course, I, I don't know, but that we're just going to call that colorway Mama G's favorite colorway, all right, because that really is. Those are staying uh, with me. The others may perhaps go into mystery bags. Or giveaways, because we're going to be doing more giveaways. Oh, yeah, at the moment that I'm filming this, I know I'm rambling, and, and well, you guys are used to this. I'll put this here so you can look at all the loveliness. Um, flip it upside down. Anyway, I since we don't do lives, uh, hey, don't forget thumbs up. And if you do, <laughs> for some odd reason, do enjoy what you're saying. I, I don't see how you could. But if you aren't subscribed and you do like what you see, this chaos, uh, please consider subscribing. We'd appreciate joining our Yarn Alicious family. Um, always could use more members. But anyway, um, since we don't do, Rusty and I don't do lives and all that, you know, I didn't worry so much about like membership things. But I was talking to Dee, and I could still do memberships. So I tried to figure out how to do that. And remember, I'm not tech savvy. And I think I might, I'm, I, I guess it's under approval now. So what the membership, if, if they approve this, so I shouldn't say anything until I know for sure. But what I'm trying to do is like, if you wanted to become a Yarnalicious family member, there's going to be one level as of the moment. And um, it's at it's two ninety nine a month, and with that, uh, if I could figure out how to do the badges, the loyalty badges, and the emojis for when we do do lives or our auctions and so forth and so on, you'll get the little badge thing. But the emoji thing, I got to figure out, and um, then also the perks would be that I haven't talked to Rusty about this yet, so you guys know before she does. And the perks would be that we will do one video a month that's just for members, right? Does that sound cool? Because I can't promise a live a month because our schedules and our mental illnesses and our, our lives are chaos. So that would be difficult to uh, to promise. But we could promise that we could do one video a month. And it would just be for, for uh, members only. And we can get into some like more crazy stuff, not just like yarn unboxings and stuff. It would be more like clearly like behind the scenes of the nut farm over here. So that would be that. And then also we would like to start doing, um, again, 
uh, like Dee does and, and other people do, um, a monthly giveaway because it, it, it's getting insane with all these little giveaway things. And we will still do the random comment, random video uh, archive thing. We'll do that like maybe once a month and then do a once a month giveaway where it'd be more of a substantial prize um, or gift. And we'll do like the tickets like D does, you know, so, but since we don't do lives, we have down below in the description box, our Venmo, PayPal, um, cash app. And then you always could do super thanks on any video for anybody, not just us. I'm just saying that on every video that any content creator puts out, there is a spot. Well, I think they have to be monetized for that, but there's a, there's a little heart thing. If you look where the like and all that stuff is, I hope you press that like thummy. Um, you could give super thanks. So I'll do like what Crystal the Yarny Chicken does is I'll write everybody's name down on a ticket and then that would all be entered into the monthly giveaway. So during our videos, I could show you what we're putting in the, in the giveaway box, right? Does that work? Because I, I, I would like to do that. It would be, better and more um, consistent and organized for my brain because these random giveaways and, and stuff are causing me uh, anxiety. So if I just know, okay, one video at this point, like we'll start at the beginning of the month and do the giveaway at the end of the month. Does that sound cool? I hope you guys are, are, are on board with that. I have no idea how you become a member. I don't know. So once it's approved, perhaps it's available on a video. That I don't know. We'll figure that out, hopefully, or I'll ask somebody. Anyway, enough of that babbling. Thank you for Bridget so much for my customized goat tote that I will be sporting around. I, I could tell you around here, because it's all farmland, people are going to want this tote. <laughs> so you may be having to go buy some more goat material. So bug Bridget for goat material. And if I could find it, I'll buy you some. But yeah, I am so, so, so excited about my goat tote. I'm going to go fill it up. And of course, we have the Queen's Craft by Bridget tag that she sews into all of her projects, which is just perfect. And uh, yeah, and this is super, super, super sturdy. So if someone does try to steal it, it'll be attached to me. I'll probably take my arm off before I would break the strap. All right. On that note, my lovelies. Um, yeah, the membership, I, I figured the first, this level would be called the Black Cats because that's what we do. The Black Cat series is what started the whole mental health and meows um, uh, fund that we do. So I thought and since I do black cat paintings, I figured we'll call that level black cat. And then if that works, maybe we'll, you know, have other, other perks and stuff. So long enough, jabber, jabber. And I love you guys. Um, have a yarnalicious day. Have a day. However it is, good, bad, or indifferent. Just be glad you're here. And um, get outside, get some fresh air, get some sunshine. And I'm not ordering, I'm suggesting. So I love you guys. Be well. And I will see you soon. Don't forget the thumbs up. Okay. And Leia, let me know in the comments what you think about that whole uh, uh, membership concept. If that's something that you'd be interested in. Love you guys. Bye-bye for now. See you next time.